All right, let's take a look at holes 15 and 16 now. We are going to be using four top spin with two left spin. I want to use two left spin after seeing how close I am getting to the right. Adjustment here is plus 15% at max. I apologize, 10% at max is the adjustment. You'll see I get very close to that bunker, so let's use a little bit more left spin and stay away from there. Now for our second shot, we're going to be using one backspin with three left spin always. Unless you find the glitchy spot. If you find that glitchy spot, then obviously respin. And here I am offsetting left edge and going 0% at club. And you'll see I'm missing this just right edge. And I was pulling an 11.59. Now for hole 16. We are going to be using different top spins based on the wind. So use two right spin always. If you have a ball where you have three, you could use three right spin. So with 6 to 6.5 miles per hour, I'm using 3.8 top spin. With 6.5 to 7 mile per hour wind, I'm using 3.6 top spin. 7 to 7.5 miles per hour wind, I'm using 3.4 topspin, and 8 miles, per hour, 8 miles per hour plus, I'm using 3 topspin. So make sure you write those down because it is important. You will go a little too far possibly if you use more topspin than you should. So we are going to adjust plus 10% at max. Once we are done, we are going to push up to max and then use full right curl. If you have an APOC 4 plus, I would recommend using that over an extra mile. Just make sure you reference the curl. And then also our landing position, look for our red ring to be touching the bunker and the yellow ring touching the rough. 